Well, thank you very much. It's great to be here today. I just want to add one additional point to everything that my colleagues have said, which is, is that this is not really an infrastructure bill. This is a woke politics bill that is being paid for with hundreds of billions of dollars in pork barrel spending. That's what this is. Why is there gender identity language in this bill? Why is there gender identity language in the digital equity portions of this bill? Why does this bill potentially create a federal cause of action around gender identity? Why does it elevate it to a protected class? These are hugely controversial decisions, hugely controversial points of law, and they're in an infrastructure bill. I think that tells you what you need to know about this bill. It's not really about infrastructure at all. It's about woke politics. Why is President Biden so enthusiastically for it? Because it advances his far left agenda. The Green New Deal, elements of it across this bill, the climate change agenda, it's stuffed into this bill, quotas for this, that, and the other in this bill. So this is a bill that is about the woke political agenda of the left. It is being paid for with this massive pork barrel spending. And I just hope Republicans will open their eyes to what's actually in the bill. You know, when you get a bill this late in the process that's 2,700 plus pages long, sometimes it's tempting not to actually look and see what's in the bill. Folks should look and see what's in this bill. I think it's going to be awfully hard to explain to Republican voters that we have gone along or some Republicans have gone along with this kind of an agenda, this sort of a social agenda, this kind of pork barrel spending. And so I think it's absolutely vital that Republicans take a principled stand and say we're not going to be part of Joe Biden's left wing agenda. We're not going to advance his woke political agenda. We're going to stand up for the principles that we share and believe in as Americans. We're going to stand up for some basic fiscal responsibility. And for those reasons, we're going to vote no on this bill. Thanks for having me. Any questions? Yes, sir.